Carolina and Company Live is sponsored by the businesses, organizations, and groups featured in this program. The views and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect that of WPDE ABC 15, WWMB CW 21, or its employees. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. Your source for fun, entertainment, and events right here in Scotland County. With your host, Cecil Chandler and Amanda Sellers. If it's happening in Scotland County, it's on right here. And hello, everybody. Welcome to Carolina and Company Live. We are on the road to the Laurenburg, Scotland County area, and we're at our host right now in that Small Business Innovation Center. That's right. But we've got a lot of things we're going to find out and visit today. That's right. We're going to learn about what they do, the Small Business Center connections, what they do. Deborah's great. She's the director. But also, we're going to find out some things from the chamber. They've got a lot of upcoming events and Scotland Healthcare. You got that right. Just some of the things you're going to see today on the show. So stick around. We'll be right back. Your first warning weather with meteorologist Brittany Van Voorhees. After this morning's mess, it's actually going to be a really nice afternoon if you're staying close to home for the busiest travel time of the year. Temperatures this afternoon in the upper 60s and low 70s everywhere. It's also going to be breezy this afternoon with wind coming in sharp in out of the north. Right around 10 to 15 miles per hour, so of course definitely feeling breezy at times, but with clearing skies, it's going to be a really nice evening and overnight. As we head through future cast for the rest of the day, you can see here skies will clear. Of course, only a few clouds out there for your Wednesday afternoon and into the early evening hours. But the clear skies overnight means the chance for some radiational cooling as we head through Wednesday evening and into the day on Thursday. Now, for your travel forecast, if you're heading maybe not close to home, somewhere else across the country, two portions of South Georgia into the state of Florida, some light rain there. Otherwise, to the Pacific Northwest, we're tracking a little bit of rain and potentially even a mix for far northern portions of those areas. Otherwise, that low pressure system, we've also been watching to the New England state, which is a busy, very busy travel area, it started to back off just a bit, but you can potentially expect some delays from most areas if you are traveling by plane. And of course, by car, you want to use some extra caution there also. You can see a little bit of rain for portions of the south, but for us here in the Carolinas, it's actually going to be pretty nice on this Wednesday. And then parts of the Rockies could see some mix and a little bit of rain also, but it's mainly the very northwestern portions of the country that will see some issues for the rest of your Wednesday. Now for Thanksgiving tomorrow, of course, a very nice day to get out with friends and family. Family. Temperatures in the morning in the mid to upper 40s, so definitely cooler than we have been seeing. We'll start out clear, but of course, a few more clouds building in by the late morning and into the early afternoon, or we'll see an isolated shower possible for the time for feast, and of course, maybe a little bit of a nap. Temperatures mainly in the mid 50s there. And then for round two in the evening, most areas do drop into the 40s. Now, for the rest of the week, as we head into the weekend, temperatures warm back to pretty close to normal for this time of year, Saturday and Sunday, in case your loved ones are sticking around for the next seven days. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. We're showcasing different businesses and events to do right here in Scotland County. Brought to you by ABC 15 and the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. And hello everybody, welcome to Carolina and Company Live. We're right up here in Laurenburg and we're visiting the Small Business Innovation Center. Now we're going to find out exactly what they do and how they help people. That's right, Small Business Center Connections. We're going to talk to Deborah, you're the director. Yes, Tell sir. us, what does that mean? Basically, we are a small business center support to businesses in the area, existing businesses or people who want to start a business. We try to assist them in counseling. We also do seminars, which provide education to them. So we try to do the whole nine yards. Okay, so if I have an idea, if I want to start a business or if I have a business, I come to you and what happens? Well, you come to me and then we set up a time to talk. We set up a time to meet because I serve Richmond and Scotland County. Richmond okay. Community College serves both counties. So I set up a meeting and then at the meeting we talk about what you want to do or what you're already doing. And then we assess what your needs are and we start counseling from that point on. Okay. Right, Deborah, talking about the number of businesses you're help, people you're helping right now, mm -hmm. how many do you have roughly that you're working with right now? Um, basically around 10. Mm -hmm. I would say. Okay. Yeah. 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 But uh, we've helped a lot of people uh, right. in the past, and um, it, it's just it, like she said, there's a lot of people that may not know what they want to do, but they know they are designed to be entrepreneurs. 
And so we tell them also that if you're not even sure, come to us and we can help you through assessments to determine what business industry you would be a good fit for. That's good. And, okay. and you are one of the counselors? Yes, I'm assistant to Deborah Hardison. So if okay. you've got an idea, you can help them yes. mm -hmm. and put it all together. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, okay. now, in other words, can cool. you help them break down and show them what it's going to cost them to do this and exactly. all of that? We go through the whole that? process. Matter of fact, you interviewed one of our clients that started the business at Scoop and Dip in Lawrenburg a couple That's of weeks right. ago. That's right. She right. mentioned you yeah. guys. Exactly. We started from her from scratch, basically with the idea, and then we broke it all the way down to what she needed, help her do her business plan, help her also do her um, financial plan to apply for a business loan and things of that nature. Yeah, because I feel like when people, you know, want to start a business, it's a, they have a great idea, but they sometimes get Don't discouraged. Well, they get discouraged yeah. because it's a lot of pieces to put mm -hmm. together. So mm -hmm. if somebody wants to contact you guys and get started, how do they do that, and how many businesses can you help? Well, actually, as much capacity we, both of us can do in counseling <laughs> hours, because we try to spend at least an hour with a client. Okay. So basically, it's if we can do 10, if we can do 20, it just depends on what they need. So I have some clients that come in and they already have an idea. They basically just need to help to write the business plan. Um, but we have some clients like Shalanda that we start from scratch and kind of just flesh out the idea and then really work through. You know, Shalanda and I worked together probably about a year okay. before she got her business off. She was real good at wanting to plan and make sure everything's in place. No. All right, now, so probably some people watching right now that are thinking, wow, I've got an idea and I want to do something. Mm -hmm. How can they get in touch with you? What do they do? you have a website or what can they do? Actually, we're on RCC's website, which is richmondcc.edu, and you can just type in Small Business Center. You can also contact us via email at ddhardison at richmondcc.edu, or you can call us at 910-410-1687. All right, now coming up in May, there's some classes that we need to talk about. Yeah, there's a series of classes called Real, that's Rural Entrepreneur Action Learning Classes. These classes will actually take place on May the 2nd, the 4th, and the 9th. They'll be at the Honeycutt Center at, uh, in Longburg, North Carolina. And these classes will actually walk you through from business startup to finish. And the, we will, uh, you can actually go to our website, uh, that's tiny.cc slash SBC seminars and you can okay. register individually for each of these standalone classes. Very mm -hmm. good. So you can register right. people can register for those and get yes, involved. Absolutely. Very good. All right. All right. Thank you so Thanks, much. Girls. All right, All right guys, we'll welcome. be right back. The Laurenburg Maxton Airport Industrial Park in Scotland County includes over 4,000 acres of prime industrial sites with almost 1,800 acres ready for industrial and commercial development. The industrial park offers full service infrastructure that includes a newly renovated runway, plus water, sewer, electric, and natural gas. So whether you're looking to build or simply expanding your current business, we invite you to come join the many businesses that already call the industrial park home. Call today. Whether you're a local or on your way home from the beach, stop in at Exit 184 Laurenburg. Feeling hungry? Then stop in for a quick bite at the Dog House Express. Order up a signature northern, southern, or hand-dipped corn dog. Need to get your car serviced? Then look no further than Haney's Tire and Recapping Service. Once you try us, we're sure you'll be back for more. And if you need a vehicle, stop in at Scotland Motors. You'll find over 400 pre-owned vehicles, and remember, go look at the rest, then come buy from the best. Looking for a wonderful shopping experience? Then shop downtown Laurenburg. Hungry? Visit 215 on Main for a quick meal. Shirt Tales specializes in personalized garments for school, churches, clubs, and more. Find the perfect tuxedo rental and more at Harley's Tuxedo and Gifts. From trendy to obscure, you can find the perfect gift at Scotland Bling. If it's happening in Scotland County, you'll hear it first on 95.1, your hometown radio, WLNC. Shop downtown Laurenburg. How can I possibly be expected to go without Domino's on a day like this? Alexa, ask Domino's to place my easy order. Ordering Domino's. Life moves pretty fast. If you can't track your pizza, you could miss it. Order two medium, two topping pizzas for just $5.99 each and track them on your favorite device. You're watching Carolina & Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. We're showcasing different businesses and events to do right here in Scotland County. Brought to you by ABC 15 and the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. And welcome back to Carolina & Company Live right here at the Weekend Warrior Trading Company. All kinds of cool stuff in here for your weekend. Great brands, Fish Hippie, Southern Marsh. They've got kayaks in here. 
I think it's a pretty cool place. They got everything in here. It's right next to the art park out here, and you come next door and you get to see all of this cool stuff. Now, when That's they right. told me Weekend Warrior, I thought we were going to the National Guard. They used to call me a Weekend Warrior. But now we've got a lot of cool stuff here that we're going to talk about. We're going to start with Harley first. Now, Harley, how did all this come about? Um, basically, uh, we had an idea, and it went from there. Um, when I used to work at shoe department in Laurenburg uh, mm -hmm. in around 2009, when I first started college, I noticed that Laurenburg uh, didn't have a lot of the brands that people were looking for. Yeah. And it, that's where it came from. It stimulated from there, and having an entrepreneurial, uh, I, I guess, spirit, it evolved and here we are today so cool. um, right. I mean, it means you can offer the stuff that people want right here locally that's right we're trying to keep the uh local economy booming <laughs> as, right, i guess you would, that's what you're going to devin on the end he's one of your uh, partners right yes sir now devin what did you think when all of this came about were you happy to i was excited it? as really? soon as he told me the opportunity i jumped in i dove in as quick as i could um this is always something i've wanted to do and i love and we've been we've been working on stuff since we were in high school so uh, we were glad to be a part of Scotland County, and we really wanted to do this. Very All right. Cool. Did you notice they have some uh, leather work they over do, there? They do, absolutely. John, you started doing the leather work how long ago, man? About three years ago. Three years ago? Yeah. All right, just, now, what all can you make here? What all you do? Pretty much anything. Belts, wallets, you name it, I can try to do it. And you do all the work in the back, so you have it available here in yes, the store? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And that means it'd be cut, like if I have an idea, it can be cut, customized to what I want? That's what I specialize in, customizing. Very cool. That's good. All right, now, your fun, the most fun thing in here, I would think, would be the kayaks. Yes, now, sir. Are you a kayak? I, I've, I've been a few times. <laughs> I haven't been as much as I want to go because yeah. I stay busy, but it, it's fun. If uh, I, I tell you, if no one's tried it, you need to try it at least once in your lifetime. Absolutely. Well, yeah, and us being down close to the beach, we're in kayaks and canoes all the time, but it's pretty cool. You guys have a lot of places and rivers you can go to up yep. here. Yep. Lumber River is, uh, Lumber River Chalk Banks is the yeah. closest access for us. Um, uh, it's open, what is it, from 5 o'clock up to 5. Yeah. yeah. So you got a lot yep. of time you can go down there. Yep. All right. Now, Devin, talking about, you know, being in this business, um, how long have y'all been open now? We've been open since November 26th, and God's been good to us so far. It's been a good, it's been really good. Uh, business has been great. We have a great um, community here in Laurenburg that's really supported us. Thank, to, thank you to everyone that has, and uh, we're excited. We're really excited what's going on. Cool, and uh, I heard you guys are getting some new brands coming in, spring, summer stuff coming um, in. Yeah, we're looking into a, a brand called Maripex Apparel for uh, shorts for men. Uh, we're getting a lot of people uh, asking about uh, cargo, I mean, not cargoes, but khaki shorts. Yeah. Um, and maybe some more uh, T-shirt brands, uh, maybe even Patagonia here in the future. Cool. So, now, yeah. some of the things you've got in here, everything from hats, uh, backpacks, everything. Mm -hmm. Tell yeah. me what all you got in here. Uh, we... we we specialize in uh, basically any, I, I like to call it outdoor lifestyle apparel, um, <laughs> uh, fish hippie, uh, t-shirts, um, uh, swimming trunks from Saudi crew, uh, let's see, you got uh, it backpacks from Topo Designs. And uh, there's a hammock right over there. Yes, hammocks. Portable from, and uh, easy. From, yeah, that, that company is based out of Colorado, so uh, right. Elevate Hammock Company is the name. Cool. So we thank all you guys for being with us. Right, it's awesome. Good. If you guys you. have not been down here, come check it out right here. On the corner, I guess, of Main Street, right by the art park. See you in a minute. This is not some place you have to be. This is a place that you want to be. Oh. You get that feeling when you come in that, wow, I'm home. People that live in neighborhoods, they come and say, oh my gosh, I mean, it's so well developed. Six o'clock this morning, I was in the fitness center. Yeah. We'll be tomorrow, walk in the days in between, swim. Enthusiasm, that's what they have here, enthusiasm. So come on down and join us. We'd love to have you. All right, we're at Nick's Pick Quick, and you guys, if you want anything, a snack, lunch, all kinds of stuff, this is the place to go. You can even sit down and eat your lunch, or you can pick it quick and run out the door. They've got fried chicken. And lots of sides. They've got pizza. They've got drinks. They've got nuts. You want an almond? No, thank you. They've got stuff for your car, too. And if you need a pick-me-up, they've got great coffee. Nick's Pick Quick. With 16 locations. One just around the corner from you.
Looking for a wonderful shopping experience? Then shop downtown Laurenburg. Hungry? Visit 215 on Main for a quick meal. Shirt Tales specializes in personalized garments for school, churches, clubs, and more. Find the perfect tuxedo rental and more at Harley's Tuxedo and Gifts. From trendy to obscure, you can find the perfect gift at Scotland Bling. If it's happening in Scotland County, you'll hear it first on 95.1, your hometown radio, WLNC. Shop downtown Laurenburg. How can I possibly be expected to go without Domino's on a day like this? Alexa, ask Domino's to place my easy order. Ordering Domino's. Life moves pretty fast. If you can't track your pizza, you could miss it. Order two medium, two topping pizzas for just $5.99 each and track them on your favorite device. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. We're showcasing different businesses and events to do right here in Scotland County. Brought to you by ABC 15 and the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. And welcome back to Carolina and Company Live. We're on the road up in Laurenburg, North Carolina, and now we're visiting Aaron's, where you can lease any kind of furniture, TVs, appliances, whatever you're looking for. They've got it right here. They sure do. Justin's going to tell us a little bit about it. First of all, where are you guys located here in Laurenburg? We're located on Main Street in Laurenburg, uh, 401 West Main Street. Okay. And uh, so it's right tell here uh, in front of, like, beside Papa John's in front of Big Lots. Perfect. Oh, okay. Tell us about the store. What do you guys do? We leased on furniture, um, TVs, washing machines, anything basically you look for to fill your home. We got it here. We offer 12 months, 18 months, and 24 months leased to own. So we have a 120 day savings cash option, so you can pay it out savings cash within 120 days without any finance charges and stuff like that. Oh, okay. That's pretty, pretty good. Now, you got anything in here you want? I was looking at some different things. Now, the couches and all. If I come in, you set up an arrangement for me to lease that so much per week or month. How do y'all do that, Justin? We do it either um, bi-weekly, every two weeks, or yeah. monthly. Okay. So. Very good. Now, if I get something in here, what is the delivery time? And you guys will deliver it, obviously, to the house, yeah, correct? Yeah, we deliver it to the house. We set it up for you. We try and get it there that day, but it might be the next day or as soon as, you know, the schedule allows us to, but it'll be within a couple of days. So you buy it straight from the store in here? Yes, ma'am. All right, and if you guys are out of stock with something, you just order it? We'll order it in and be in on Fridays. So y'all take care of all the How financing and everything, right? Y'all do all the financing? Everything's handled right here. In-house. That's pretty good. So if I came in and bought a, uh, got a $1,200 TV, but what, is, what do you say? What happens if I don't like that TV, Justin? What well, happens? you can return it. You can bring it back? You can bring it back and choose another one out of the store if you like. or You know, Figure we, out. we're here to make you happy, so you can come back and if you want to upgrade or do something like that, you can take care of that. Definitely yourself. upgrade. Hey, always like upgrade. That. That's right. Always, what, are you, what are your hours and your um, the days you're open? We're open from 10 to 7, okay. four days out of the week. And then on Fridays, we're open until 8. And then um, Saturdays, we close at 6. Okay. All right, now where are you so, from originally? Originally, Fairmont, North Carolina. All right, right down the road a little ways. Yes, sir. Now, how long you been with Aaron? I've been with Aaron's for about four months now. Oh, really? Do you okay. like it? Four or five months. Yeah. Well, the yeah. man back here has been here a long yeah. time. Oh, yeah. That man right has been here for a while. <laughs> <laughs> well, we appreciate you coming in and letting us talk about all the stuff you have in here today. Yeah. Now, in our average day, do you have a lot of people come in, or is it on a rush time, or weekly, or how does it work sometimes? We, we stay busy um, pretty regularly. Uh, some days, you know, it slacks off, but yeah. for the most part, we have a steady um, I'm amount sure of people. I'm sure spring in coming, people are wanting to do new things with their houses. I yeah. mean, that's what I want to do. I always want to, let's get some new stuff. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure you see that yeah. with the summer yeah. coming. Well, we, le we lease out lawnmowers and, and grills, too. So that's really? right oh. now, people are coming in and getting riding lawnmowers and grills with us and stuff like that. I didn't know that. Oh. Let me ask the question. What if, say, somebody didn't have perfect credit? Can they still get something? We don't here? do credit checks. Y'all don't do credit checks? No, sir. Okay. Wow, how about that? So you just come in, you'll be able to get it. Mm -hmm. Get them financed for some yeah, lease options. Yeah, we finance and everything like that. We try and help out people. And so, yeah, no sure, credit People get into bad credit in. once yeah, in a you, while. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Stuff happens, so. Yeah, it does. Well, yeah. this seems like a perfect place to come then. Yeah. Find right. anything you want. Com I like this couch. It's comfortable, right? Yeah. yeah. Very comfortable. <laughs> oh, man, this is a lot of fun. Thank you so much for being with us. and appreciate well, you telling yeah. us all about Absolutely. it. Absolutely. All right, we're on the road up in Laurenburg. We're right now at Aaron's. Come by. You might find something that you like. That's right. We'll see you in a second. This is not some place you have to be. This is a place that you want to be. Oh, dear, Doug. 
you get that feeling when you come in that, wow, I'm home. People that live in neighborhoods, they come and say, oh my gosh, I mean, it's so well developed. Six o'clock this morning, I was in the fitness center. Yeah. We'll be tomorrow, walk in the days in between, swim. Enthusiasm, that's what they have here, enthusiasm. So come on down and join us. We'd love to have you. All right, we're at Nick's Pick Quick, and you guys, if you want anything, a snack, lunch, all kinds of stuff, this is the place to go. You can even sit down and eat your lunch, or you can pick it quick and run out the door. They've got fried chicken. And lots of sides. They've got pizza. They've got drinks. They've got nuts. You want an almond? No, thank you. They've got stuff for your car, too. And if you need a pick-me-up, they've got great coffee. Nick's Pick Quick. With 16 locations. One just around the corner from you. The Laurenburg Maxton Airport Industrial Park in Scotland County includes over 4,000 acres of prime industrial sites with almost 1,800 acres ready for industrial and commercial development. The industrial park offers full service infrastructure that includes a newly renovated runway, plus water, sewer, electric, and natural gas. So whether you're looking to build or simply expanding your current business, we invite you to come join the many businesses that already call the industrial park home. Call today. Whether you're a local or on your way home from the beach, stop in at exit 184 Laurenburg. Feeling hungry? Then stop in for a quick bite at the Dog House Express. Order up a signature northern, southern, or hand-dipped corn dog. Need to get your car serviced? Then look no further than Haney's Tire and Recapping Service. Once you try us, we're sure you'll be back for more. And if you need a vehicle, stop in at Scotland Motors. You'll find over 400 pre-owned vehicles. And remember, go look at the rest, then come buy from the best. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. We're showcasing different businesses and events to do right here in Scotland County. Brought to you by ABC 15 and the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. And welcome back to Scotland Healthcare Systems in Laurenburg. We're on the road and right now we're visiting inside the hospital to the imaging department and we're going to find out just what they do here. That's right. You think of imaging department, x-ray, but they do a wide scheme of all kinds of stuff. We have Becky and Joe with us. Becky, tell us, who do you serve in this department? What do you do? We do x-rays here in the department. We also do fluorine studies, and we do uh, bone surveys. Okay. And bone studies right here. And, and here, so, so what is this machine? Go ahead and tell me. What, what is the machine that's behind this me? This is a uh, DEXA scan. It's okay. for uh, people that have uh, early stages of osteoporosis. Oh, okay, so it can detect those and help you come up with a plan to prevent them? Yes, mm -hmm. ma'am. Okay, interesting. Now, Joe, what is what is your job here? What do you do on a daily basis? Tell me about your job. daily basis, we x-ray people with a wide range of different things. Uh, go to OR and do studies with the surgeons, make sure everything's going correct in the operating room. All right, now this machine here, does this go up and down? It scans the whole body, right? Yes, sir, but this mainly what we scan is the uh, L-spine and your hips is what we scan. Okay, so it's looking for osteoporosis, which is in your spine, in your back. My grandmother had osteoporosis, mm -hmm. and I'm sure something like this would have helped to, you know, get her into some type of therapy, and is that, then you guys refer them out? Is that how it works? You work with the doctors? Yes, ma'am. Usually what we do, once they get the scan and they get it read, what'll happen is they might put them on uh, calcium, or okay. might even give them a, change their diet around a little bit to help them, to keep them from falling in that category. All right, okay. now Joe, how long have you been doing this? I've been doing this for five years. Five years? Where yes, are you from originally? Lumberton, North Carolina. Right down the road? Yeah. Yes, sir. Right. Little how way. about you, Becky? I'm from Lombard. You're from Lombard? Yes, ma'am. Lombard, right here. John Station. <laughs> All right, fantastic. All right, now putting this together, this the advancement in this area, the technology has improved. Every year, something's getting better, isn't it, Becky? I mean, you're getting more technology. Always, every year. Always updating, trying to make sure patients get exactly what they need, high-quality equipment, and uh, excellent service. Okay. All right, now you don't, you don't just serve Laurenburg. I mean, you got people no, coming sir. from South Carolina. Yes, mm -hmm. sir. We've got coming from Bennettsville. We have them coming from Macau. Uh, we actually, I've seen a few people coming from Lumberton. Okay, now, yeah, now, do you guys, I know this is, uh, you're looking for osteoporosis, but now somebody who breaks their arm, a child that comes and breaks their arm, is this the place they would come, the imaging department here? Is that how that works, or is this a you, different type of imaging department? Um, they would come here, but usually from the, the emergency room, and we would, we would, go over and do the x-rays of the child okay. in the emergency room and work with the emergency room doctor there. This is more of a, the DEXA scan itself is more of a uh, preventative. Oh, okay. that kind of Interesting. gets you ready. In other words, find out what you need and the treat what you need. Yes, sir. And then that takes care of it. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's yes, pretty sir. good. All right, that's nice. Uh, can I 
lie down? Absolutely. <laughs> no, I'm just yeah. kidding. I'm yeah, just right. Kidding. Well, just, go ahead. This no, is yeah. Well, what were some that you were telling me at the beginning, some other things that you guys do? We uh, actually do CT here as well. Okay, so, so you guys every day you do ultrasound and CT scans on the patients? Well, we have, uh, those are some of the departments in the imaging department. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so there's a lot of different things you can have done when you come to the imaging department. Yes, Different modalities, yes, ma'am. Okay. So you can do it all right here, though, when you come in. One stop you shop. That's right. The first thing you can find out, like a broken arm, mm -hmm. you're going to take care of that first, then you can send you over here to check x rays and all. Yes, sir. Right? All right. Yes, sir. I think I got it. You got it? Yeah. Okay, I think so. <laughs> Thank you guys both <laughs> so you much. So oh, you're welcome. Okay. You guys stick around. We'll be right back. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. All right, we're at Nick's Pick Quick, and you guys, if you want anything, a snack, lunch, all kinds of stuff, this is the place to go. You can even sit down and eat your lunch, or you can pick it quick and run out the door. They've got fried chicken. And lots of sides. They've got pizza. They've got drinks. They've got nuts. You want an almond? No, thank you. They've got stuff for your car, too. And if you need a pick-me-up, they've got great coffee. Nick's Pick Quick. With 16 locations. One just around the corner from you. The Laurenburg Maxton Airport Industrial Park in Scotland County includes over 4,000 acres of prime industrial sites with almost 1,800 acres ready for industrial and commercial development. The industrial park offers full-service infrastructure that includes a newly renovated runway, plus water, sewer, electric, and natural gas. So whether you're looking to build or simply expanding your current business, we invite you to come join the many businesses that already call the Industrial Park home. Call today. Whether you're a local or on your way home from the beach, stop in at Exit 184 Laurenburg. Feeling hungry? Then stop in for a quick bite at the Dog House Express. Order up a signature northern, southern, or hand-dipped corn dog. Need to get your car serviced? Then look no further than Haney's Tire and Recapping Service. Once you try us, we're sure you'll be back for more. And if you need a vehicle, stop in at Scotland Motors. You'll find over 400 pre-owned vehicles, and remember, go look at the rest, then come buy from the best. Looking for a wonderful shopping experience? Then shop downtown Laurenburg. Hungry? Visit 215 on Main for a quick meal. Shirt Tales specializes in personalized garments for school, churches, clubs, and more. Find the perfect tuxedo rental and more at Harley's Tuxedo and Gifts. From trendy to obscure, you can find the perfect gift at Scotland Bling. If it's happening in Scotland County, you'll hear it first on 95.1, your hometown radio, WLNC. Shop downtown Laurenburg. How could I possibly be expected to go without Domino's on a day like this? Alexa, ask Domino's to place my easy order. Ordering Domino's. Life moves pretty fast. If you can't track your pizza, you could miss it. Order two medium, two topping pizzas for just $5.99 each and track them on your favorite device. You're watching Carolina and Company on the road with the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. We're showcasing different businesses and events to do right here in Scotland County. Brought to you by ABC 15 and the Laurenburg Chamber of Commerce. And we've had a great show here today on the road in Scotland County. We learn so much stuff when we come up here. Always new things happening in this area. That's right. If you want to find out what's going on in Laurenburg, Scotland County, you got to tune in on a Wednesday because we're always up here and we're always on the road having a lot of fun. That's right. We'll see you next Wednesday right here on the road. Carolina and Company Live is sponsored by the businesses, organizations, and groups featured in this program. The views and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect that of WPDE, ABC 15, WWMB, CW 21, or its employees.